hi there in this video today I am going to show you how to take photographs and videos from your iPhone or iPad and copy them onto your computer I know that um, there's iCloud and there's other <coughs> online photo backup programs but I'm going to show you how to complete the process anyway which may be good if you have too many photos or if um, if you're just looking to, to, to make a backup first thing to do is on your machine create a new folder just right click anywhere on your desktop and create a new folder and, um, and just give it a name and this is where we'll copy them to um, next thing to do is connect your iPhone to your computer I'll just do that now um, if it's the first time you've did it the computer might install hardware um, and iTunes might ask you to trust the the device or the computer to access the device just do that um, we're actually not going to use iTunes for this it op opens automatically so we're just going to close that down um, focusing on this one here we want to uh, select this option to, to view the files in the device if you don't get any menu like that then what you want to do is open up um, starting in computer and uh, then you'll see your, your iPhone or iPad here I'm just going to tap into that, tap into the internal storage, uh, tap into the DCIM folder and you might have more than one folder here so you might need to dig and see where the photos you're looking for are so mine's are probably going to be in the first one and these ones here are the 145 photos that I've got in the camera roll um, and I'm not too sure you know how many there is in, in terms of size so mine's is 1.1 gig uh, but as you can see the date created from you know, the start of November so you know in, in just over a month I've racked up one gigabyte of photos and videos um, if I'm using iCloud initially you've only got an allowance of five gigabytes I'm, I'm going to fill that up in a number of months um, so personally I use Dropbox to upgrade my photos or to, to back up my photos but um, if you're looking to do it manually then this is how you go about doing it so what you can do at this point is just right click and um, yeah, there's no select all so you can do control on A and that will select all the files in the folder or you can hold control and pick individual files that you want to, to go and back up or you can drag and select uh, a number of files um, so I'm actually going to go and back up um, all of these ones so select the files you want to, to back up uh, and then just pretty much just drag and drop them off so you can see I'm copying across to this folder let go um, and they'll be transferred across once they are transferred across if you find um, you're running in short space on a device you can delete the, the images that are stored on there so Windows is giving us an estimate of 2 minutes Okay, so they're copied over now. We're happy with that. Um, so if I wanted to, then I can just press delete. Uh, sorry, select the, the images again. Uh, I can just press delete. And then, yes, and it'll take them off the device and that frees up the space I've got on there. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to keep them on there just now. That's pretty much all that's involved. If you have any questions, then um, you know, please let me know and I'll help you out if I can. Thanks for watching.